And um, you know, I woke up that morning and had a voicemail from Dave and called him back and you know said I won. Just uh, you know, listened for it on uh, you know uh, ESPN and uh, you know called my family and you know they're they're really excited. Okay, so I mean, I had a chance to talk to your dad a couple of weeks beforehand, and he had said, "So, uh, Nick, uh, Jeremy's going to win that Rookie of the Year." I said, "Yeah." I said, "He's got." I mean, uh, your numbers were. I mean, where did you think your odds were? You knew that uh, Eric Hosmer with the Royals is going to be a big candidate, as well as uh, Trumbo with the Angels. Yeah, I mean, those two guys, um, you know, Nova from New York, um, no. and there's a few other guys too. I mean, I knew I had a, a good chance. But, you know, there's a lot of guys out there that had, you know, just a good a chance. So, um, you know, of course I wanted to win it and, you know, I was very happy to win it. And, um, you know, I think these guys are my teammates. Yeah, so I want to bring in these guys too. When, when uh, an award go is bestowed upon you, I mean, you guys really have been showered as well. One of your pitchers is Rookie of the Year, okay? Manager, Manager of the Year. That really kind of goes to the entire staff. Um, do you... Do you try and take full credit? Because really, you guys kind of get swept under the rug as not getting enough credit for a lot of these accolades. How do you receive them? Well, we always try to take full credit, absolutely. Good. I, I think if it wasn't for Stan and I, Jeremy Stop. would have had no Just chance like to be the rookie. <laughs> 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 <la